In this video, I'm going to introduce the idea of a diagonalization. A diagonalization is a special example of what we call a factorization. And a factorization is much like what it sounds. If you factor a polynomial, you write it as the product of other polynomials. If you factor a matrix, you write it as the product of other matrices. And the factorization we're looking at specifically the diagonalization is when you take a matrix, a square matrix, we should specify, and you write it as a matrix times another matrix times the inverse of the first matrix. And of these three matrices, the center one needs to have a special form. And this form is where this word comes from. The center matrix needs to be a diagonal. And a diagonal matrix is a matrix that is allowed to be non-zero only on the main diagonal, above the main diagonal, and below the main diagonal, this matrix is zero. We have much to say about the diagonalization. It's the topic of this entire section. For now, I'll just make the observation that you sometimes see diagonalizations presented differently. In particular, you sometimes see the inverse on the left instead of on the right. This isn't a real difference. Um, in particular, if A is P inverse times D times P, and we call Q, P inverse, then A is Q inverse times D times Q. So whether the inverse is on the left or on the right doesn't really change anything.